Welcome back to Exploring with Ash and Jake. If you like all things dark, mysterious, and supernatural, you've come to the right place. Hit that like and subscription button like a clown is chasing you with a knife. Without further ado, let's get to today's story. Today we're going to be talking about a knife man in a creepy clown suit who invaded a school play yard and started to stare at children. I don't know about you, but I think if I was a child in this case, I'd be very scared. Without further ado, let's get into the story. A knife-wielding man who showed up at a primary school dressed as a clown has dodged a jail sentence after claiming it was a prank. Joellis, 21, stood on AstroTurf, a primary school in Manchester, wearing a creepy mask, staring at children in a threatening way. On December 22nd, Manchester court heard when pupils at the Woolburn Primary School moved away from him. Willis followed them even when the children seemed to be in distress. The school's Head teacher was eventually forced to bring the absolutely petrified children inside and called 999 shortly after 5 p.m., claiming Willis was exhibiting threatening behavior. The prosecutor, Mark Pitchard, said the head teacher said she usually the AstroTurf is open for public use after hours and children and families often play there. He told 999 caller handler that the defendant was standing there staring at the children moving towards them in a very threatening manner. When the children moved away, he would follow them even if they were distressed. Half an hour later, the police found and located Willis near the school, and then he was found to have a large kitchen knife hidden up his sleeve. He admitted to the possession of the knife and said that the incident was a prank. On Friday, October 21st, Willis was given a suspended sentence and avoided jail. He goes on to claim that he has several illnesses like autism and what have you, and he receives some distressing news, and so the clown mask and the knife was just a prank. I don't know about you, regardless of whatever physical or mental health issue you have, you still shouldn't be able to get away with welding a butcher knife or an, or a um, dangerous weapon of any kind on a campus, whether it be real or fake. Um, this is just a little bit out of hand. If you read this story, let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you decide, are you on the side of, um, Wellis or are you on the side of the court? I pretty much think he should have been prosecuted, but it doesn't look like that happened. And that's very shocking to me. As always, I hope everyone's having a great day. Stay weird, keep exploring, and peace out. I also just want to let everyone know that we do have a Facebook page called Exploring with Ash and Jake YouTube, so feel free to check that out. We post lots of other content that we don't post on our YouTube channel. Also, for the person who becomes the 300th subscriber to our YouTube channel, they will be getting a prepaid $60 Visa gift card.